welcome back. You may remember Justin Hartley <laughs> from This Is Us, but Justin Hartley has a new action drama coming to CBS. He came by our studios to chat about it with the lot Suzanne Marquez, who's joining us now. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. He's such a dream, isn't mm -hmm. he? A dream boat. Can I just say it? <laughs> and Rudy and Rachel, Justin Hartley teamed up with his executive producer from This Is Us to bring Tracker to CBS and Paramount Plus, premiering right after the Super Bowl. He stars as Coulter Shaw, a loner and survivalist, traveling the country, solving mysteries for hire. Justin, congratulations on Tracker. It looks absolutely incredible. And it's also a labor of love for you. Yeah, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, man, we started this. Ken Olin and I started this a long, long time ago. We, we started actually a year before This Is Us started filming wow. their final season. So it's been it's been quite a long journey. We're finally here and, and um, in the best possible way premiering after the Super Bowl. So being teed up in a, in a rather large way, which is great. And let's talk about your character. He's a man of action for sure. And he's a listener. And then he kind of just responds with, um, he talks, but he responds with action more than I would say, you know, conversing and stuff like that. He will, he will have a conversation with someone if it means getting something out of them that he needs to solve or to find someone, whoever he's looking for, whatever it might be, or to get information. Well, I'm one of those people who have never camped outside. I'll, okay. I'll, do, I'll do glamping. Okay. How about you? Would you ever be able to live like I him? Have. I have. Well, live, I don't know. Li <laughs> live, like, permanently, I don't know. I, I, I do enjoy a TV. Yeah. Um, I enjoy, you know, <laughs> I enjoy heat and air conditioning. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I could, I could see myself doing it. I have before for extended periods of time. I, I, I enjoy it. But as long as you have the AC, the heat. Well, as long as there's an the end game, you know, there's an end game. It's like we're out here for, you know, if we're out here for like four or five days, great. If we're out here for like, you know, four or five months, that's like, that's cutting into football season. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Are yeah. there certain things you're doing that have maybe been inspired by the show? I, gr I put a, I grew a garden. Really? I did these big, my wife and I have these big um, garden boxes, raised garden so boxes. That we, yeah, that we planted all of our, yeah. And I'm like, we should make our own food. We should get, I'm like, I went, I was like, we should get chickens. We should do the whole thing. We didn't get chickens. But I got chickens. Did you? Yes. Okay. How's it going? It's great. Yeah. We just keep them in a pen, though, because we're okay. in Studio City. You can't, like, let them I think roam I, free. I think I've heard your chickens. <laughs> you probably have. I think I've heard I'm <laughs> Right? No roosters. We promise. My neighbor had a rooster, actually. Oh, that Lord. Was, yeah, yeah. No alarm clock needed. Well, I love all the work you've been doing lately, too. Um, do you credit it to the This Is Us fame? Does it feel like this is such a special time in your life? It's pretty great. I mean, you know, what's, what's interesting is, especially as an actor, you're lucky to get a job. And then to be able to keep a job and then sustain a career for an extended period of time, I still can't believe uh, that I've been doing this for as long as I have. It seems like I just got here. But, um, but yeah, you know, one thing, work begets work, I guess. But when you do a special project like This Is Us, it certainly, I think, shines a different light on you in other people's eyes, which, is, which has been great, you know, for me. Um, I, I don't know if I would have been given this opportunity if it weren't for that show. So I, I owe a lot to him. And now that I have this job, um, you know, I mean, we, Ken and I created this from inception to where we are now. We built the whole thing from the beginning to where we are now to finally see it a as a pilot in the form that it was supposed to be seen in. And then to have the network have so much faith in what they saw to give us that spot, that very coveted spot, feels really good. So, um, I don't know. I think it's a tie now, I guess. <laughs> this is, I mean, I'm doing this now, so I, maybe this is my favorite job of all time. I just, I'm, I'm having a blast doing it all. Well, it's like your baby. It, it is. It is. And a lot, you know, a lot of these things when you're producing, a lot of these things you pour your heart and soul into, and, and a lot of them never turn into anything, to be quite honest with you. And uh, when they do, it's, uh, it's special. Is there something that we can look forward to that you really had a good time doing? I got, I, I get a chance to do a lot of action. And since Smallville, which was a long, long time ago, I haven't really gotten an opportunity to do a lot of action. And uh, I, I missed it more than I realized. I really enjoy getting in there and doing it. I mean, they have to say, I think we got it. I'm like, one more take, Let's, it's fun for me, you know? <laughs> and they're like, we got it, we gotta move on. I'm like, one more, one more. Let's just do it one more time. It's like, you know, play fighting, it's awesome. That's the best. It's the best. Thank you, Justin, we'll so see you much. Then. Okay. Of course, we all know the Super Bowl starts 3.30 Sunday on CBS and Paramount+. Plus. Keep it on right after the game to watch the first episode of Tracker. He seems so sweet. Mm -hmm. Such a nice guy. He is so sweet. Thank Can't you, Susan. He has to come back soon. <laughs>